That was a big afternoon for Team North America, a sweep. Uh, from your perspective as your first time participant, I mean, that's a, that's a pretty cool thing to be a part of. Yeah, for sure. That was really fun. Uh, lots of adrenaline out there. It was fun. Uh, Mark, uh, you know how important a sweep is in terms of momentum, and uh, um, that just kind of puts such a positive vibe through your team and can have a negative effect on the other guys. Yeah, yeah, we've seen it before. A, a lead on Friday is a big thing in the Continental Cup, so we're uh, we're happy with that. You know, we've we've actually struggled in mixed doubles over the years as a team, so to clean sweep out there today was a good day. Playing mixed doubles with Mark Kennedy, uh, what was that like for you out there? What was it, what was the biggest adjustment, if anything? What was it like? Ah. Uh well, obviously he's a good sweeper, but uh, no, he's a good shooter. So it was fun. He uh, taught me some stuff out there. Never played it, so yeah, it was easy. Oh, I love it. I love it. And it, you know, you really have to have a good chemistry with your teammate and and uh, help each other out. I think we did a really good job of that today. And I, yeah, I can't wait to watch Caitlin and John play in South Korea. I think they're they've both proven themselves as great mixed doubles players. And you know, Canada's learning more and more every time we play it. And uh, I think uh, we're all getting pretty good at it. Yeah. Typically, we've been seeing uh, guys throw two, three, four, and the women. Uh, Benny, obviously, you needed someone to throw hard uh, in that one five position. I don't know what to tell you. Emma's a bully. She's like, <laughs> I'm playing the middle. I'm like, okay, no. No, I'm kidding. I mean, I don't throw a ton of hits, obviously, throwing draws, and that first one I should be able to make most of the time, and Emma's a great hitter, so we thought that was going to work best for our team, and I get to sweep more rocks than her because, unfortunately, I'm a better sweeper than her, so that's just the way it's going to go. You going to take that? He's a better sweeper than you? That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. <laughs> yeah, it's awesome. We were kind of looking over the other sheets a little bit, but our game was pretty intense at the beginning, so we are really happy to win all three games. It's awesome. Yeah, I mean, it's nice. we, were, we were saying you, know, you never want to go into the skins game having to skin somebody late, right, and have to win all the skins, so have a nice little cushion, and we've got some good horses going out tonight, and hopefully we can build on it and get to, uh, our mixed doubles teams are obviously stacked up, so we're looking to win those games again tomorrow and continue to build our lead up and you certainly want to win this thing it's not fun uh, losing to the Europeans you know they always p try to play the underdog card but they're pretty good so we want we want to take them down uh, great to see Canada US cooperation out there and uh, quite a quite a Canadian to be paired with out there oh 100 percent it was uh, we went out there and had a lot of fun and it's it's fun to play with um, like I was just telling somebody like a true professional like at her craft and it was a lot of fun to be out there there Always going to be different, especially in mixed doubles. It's so important to communicate well. Um, but I was really happy to pair, be paired with the skip because my skill set in curling is more sweeping and judging. So I need someone who's strong on strategy and line calling and reading the ice. So I thought it was a great combination when I heard we were paired up. And John's a great shooter. He lost the trials final for his mixed doubles, so I knew I had a had a good person throwing the middle. And uh, he was a great teammate over there. It was lots of fun. You found out what Reed uh, has discovered over the years. It's pretty cool to have a sweeper like Joanne Courtney on your side. One hundred percent. It's uh, you. You have somebody who can who can judge rocks and 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 pound them when you need them to be pounded. It's uh, it always makes the game of curling way easier and way more fun. So, yeah, I think we're playing well. We're doing what we need to do, and uh, I think uh, Brazil was a little nervous last night, but uh, they played a lot better today. So I think they're going to get better, even better next game. Absolutely. It's a lot of pressure. You know, the, the country's counting on us to win, and uh, even one loss would, wouldn't look the greatest. So um, it, it, we had to think about it. It wasn't an easy decision, but at the end of the day, getting a chance to represent Canada, it's hard to say no. So this is an opportunity that you, 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 you want to take advantage of. Absolutely. Uh, you know, Glenn's been to the Worlds four times. Um, obviously, I've never been to the world, so... Any, you know, a chance to wear that Canadian flag on your back is, is really special.